Oh man, real, the real gospel. Oh yeah, how do you know? Are you a Christian? Oh see, I was just telling them many of these many of these perverted people will say that they're Christians, and you're not a Christian. You have a you have a yeah yeah. Oh we do. That's why we're here. I drove about 190 miles to get there. How do you know? You you spent 30 seconds with me. You you 30 spent 30. How, how? Prove that. Come have a conversation. How is it hate? How is it hate? You're just making a claim you have no proof. How? How is it hateful? Answer my question. How is it hateful? Oh, oh, you're telling me that I'm wrong. You're a hypocrite, ma'am. And you're not a Christian. You're on your way to hell. And you need to repent. You need to repent. If you're really a Christian, quit supporting this garbage. Come back and preach the gospel. No, no you're not. Yeah, for God so loved the world, he gave his only begotten son. Whoever believes in him shall not perish, but have everlasting life. You know that? No, you need to repent of all sins. You need to repent of all sins. And you're you're in sin right now, supporting perversion. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Oh, it is conditional. Oh, you repent and believe the gospel. That's the conditions. Yeah, you just confirm what the Bible says. Yeah. So many will come to me on that day and say, Lord, Lord, did I not do many mighty works in your name? He will say, depart from me. I never knew you. So, caution. If you have deceived yourself into thinking that you're a Christian and you're supporting perversion, repent today. Trust in the real Jesus. That woman there made up a Jesus in her mind that she likes, that she loves.